James Madison. Yes, massive fan of this guy. And I said this so many times, people on this channel, regulars who's, who's watched me from like the beginning two years ago, like when, when I did transfer videos two years ago, I always said we should go and get James Madison. I, and, I, and I said, like, I mean, maybe this, this come back to bite me now. I, I always rated Madison higher than Martin Odegaard. You know, but then obviously Odegaard's been fantastic this season, and if he continues the next season, then you then you know he's probably going to be clear at Madison. But I I always thought I, I I always preferred Madison over Odegaard, but obviously now he's superb Odegaard, whatever he's proven wrong, right? But anyway, this guy talk, talk about James Madison, yeah. Recently got relegated with Leicester. Um, definitely going to be wanting to move out of the club. Been their best player for years now, um, years and years and years. You think you think of Leicester, you think the best players have got from Madison, surely. Um, closely followed by Harvey Barnes, probably. But yeah, James Madison's a baller. And uh, Leicester have apparently quoted their price uh, for teams to come out and sign James Madison because he doesn't want to leave, obviously, um, and play Premier League football. Again, next season, 40 mil is the price tag, guys. 40 mil for James Madison is their price tag. Not even that bad, in my opinion, guys. Uh, and you can't forget he's English. So, you know, English tax comes into play as well, don't it? But yes, uh, 40 mil for James Madison. For me, yes, get it done, Arsenal. You know, get this player in. People say, oh, but we've got Odegaard there. Oh, we've got Smith Rowe there. Mate, Madison is a baller. I've said this for years, man. James Madison's world class. Do you know what it is, yeah? I had a lesser fan. Uh, big up to Lee Chappie as well, the Jimmy Vardy lookalike. And he told me, Madison's been their best player this season, yeah? And he's half injured still. He's He's been carrying the same injury for about years and years now. And he's still been one of their best players. That goes to show you. I, I know Leicester have got relegated this season, right? But this man's been quality for Leicester. Bagging the goals and assists for fun, right? And he's still half injured, apparently. He's still carrying, you know, he's still got something on. I think it's something on his knee or something. He's still got this really bad knee injury, which happened a few years ago, which he still carries on today, right? This guy, to me, world class. 40 mil, I'll take it. I'll get it done. Jordan, mate, thoughts, James Madison to Arsenal. 40 million. Um, as they were talking about much, you know what is that uh, James Madison has experienced though, than, than um, Martin Edward, um in this Premier League. And um, getting Martin Edward, from Real Madrid, you know, yeah, um, chance from Arsenal, that's your guy's midfield. But Madison, he has experience. Uh, that freaky that I saw against you guys, you got, he nearly scored against the guys, and it, you guys could, um, it is Ramsdale save you guys, because he was aiming for top corner there. And you know, he's very good at free kicks. I think he's way better than, um, Kev, that was a way better one than Kevin, but James Madison, is very good because if J if Jamie Ward does step up to score or kill it, Iancho or uh, Yari Tillmans, he is the one that step up uh, for Leicester. And despite seeing him get relegated, he's a very good player as well. When they when I thought he won the FA Cup with the Foxes as well, what he do a very very good player. He's an English talented, but he's a very good. He needs to join Arsenal, and if he join Arsenal, you guys will be um he will be doing the free kicks for you guys and yeah which number you guys will be giving him um you guys have emails see me through wearing numbers maybe ten. maybe he'll get number 10 just before we'll have to get a new number maybe yeah it's which number you guys will give him yeah but he's very good with the free kicks that free kick against against you guys was a, a great that, that that's the uh that, that's a gem but ramsdale was you saw oh, it coming. Yeah, that rounds I'll save, man. That was mad, yeah. wasn't it? And it's less yeah, he's, he's, very, he's very good, man. He's very good. I rate him a lot, but this player, we're not even in the race, guys. We were in the race, we would have got this player. But um, it was it's now between Newcastle, Spurs, Man U now for him. But yeah. let's hope he join. Um, I think he will join Newcastle. Yeah, because Newcastle. But, yeah, yeah, because um, apparently Newcastle are the main team trying to look at him. I think they've been looking at this guy for a few years as well now, especially in January. I thought in January is is a done deal, but it sort of broke down a little bit. Summer again, I reckon this guy's most likely destination will be Newcastle because uh, Arsenal are not really we're interested, but we're not really like going for the guy. You know, we've got other priorities. Where Newcastle, I reckon this is one of their main targets to get in the summer. Uh, is James Madison for them? 
But yeah, guys, 40 mil. What do you guys think? For me, it's a no brainer. It's a no brainer. As you can say, he's a free kid specialist, isn't it? You know, um, look, he's even Leicester, 100%, because they got relegated, of course. And I don't see him playing in the Championship. It just doesn't seem right. James Madison in the Championship just doesn't seem right for me. Um, so, yeah, he's definitely going to, you know, look, my man got called out for England uh, a few international breaks ago, which he deserved as well. I don't even play England. World Cup last year, guys. I don't even see Madison. Yeah, wait. And he got called up for the World Cup, but again, he he had his really bad injury, which has been carrying on for years. And years. Play, play. Mm. But yeah, the guys, James Madison, let me know your thoughts about him. Uh, people, if you are tuning in, we did speak about a good one at the start. Uh, 